a puncture, that means you have a problem in your spine. Or there would be a misalignment inside. So, what's the cause of misalignment? Maybe, uh, nagbubuhat kayo ng mabibigat na, you know, uh, bagay. Mm -hmm. Or, it's your lifestyle. No? Kasi, minsan yung lifestyle natin is not, you know, hindi siya in a healthy side. Kasi minsan, hindi naman natin alam, you know, kung ano talaga yung uh, tamang posture. That's why, uh, minsan, pag nakaupo tayo, may long seating inside the office, minsan nakagano na tayo. Slouch. Right? Nakaslouch tayo. So, I'm just going to show you kung ano yung tamang posture natin. Okay. So, yeah, let's get the scoring. Okay, yeah, they are with. Let's do the head first. Head. Okay. Ah, sorry. Okay. So, we need to show it in the ears, no? So, we need to show it in the ears. So, if you're going to measure this, Kung makikita niyo dyan, mas taas yung left side niya. Okay? Okay, and then dito sa shoulder, mas taas din yung left side niya. So what's the score yeah. for head? Uh, for the head is 1. Okay, yeah. one. And here in the shoulder, I think it's only 0.5. Okay, so... Okay, and then here sa hips naman, dito sa, uh, dito sa bone, kailangan mo hawakan yun. And then the... Higher side is the right side. So here. So sa bone siya hawa. Yeah, sa bone. So it's two? Yeah. Yeah, okay. So, ito ang four. And then, um, follow up naman dito sa, okay, sa, um, this way makikita mo kung head, uh, head yung head mo forward. Yeah. So kailangan yung ears mo, ear, kailangan pantay siya. Okay, kay Miss Sarah is yung shoulder niya is medyo, nakaharap. I mean, naka-forward. And then here, okay, um, sabihin, may problem po dito sa shoulder ni Miss Sarah. Okay. So, if the score is 4, Amber, there, I have given you this copy po, uh, members of the press. So, Amber, that's 3 to 5 score, ibig sabihin, may misalignment or muscles, or imbalance sa muscle at kailangan ng professional help. Mm -hmm. Dinosaur when it comes to uh, uh, technology, so to speak, you know, social media and all. Uh, I have a 20 year old daughter who has been on a screen her entire life. Looking down, you know, we put her through ballet so she would have better posture. But the fact is, it's a very big challenge because of the screen exposure, the forward bending posture, the amount of time we spend in school, the amount of time we spend on the screen. So all of these things affect our general posture. So it's a combination of the things that you do all day, pardon, things that you do all day. It's a combination of the amount of physical activities that you engage into in a regular way. I use the word regular. And so we want to have, as I say this, you know, the eyes are the mirror to your soul. Yes. And posture is a mirror to your health. Yes. Thank you.